Don't feed the trolls and why? Um, I was talking about this with Ella Winter the other night, actually. Um, because, I I mean, I, I apologise to Ella because I know he wants to bring it up. Um, but I thought it's an important subject uh, because of some of the stuff ongoing. Um, I do think a lot of this trolling stuff's been going on far too long. Um, in the Philippines community, and I'll be honest with you, I'm part of the Spanish community, I'm part of the drone community, and a few other places, and the most negative one is the Philippines. Um, now, there is reasons why, and this also comes into this. First thing I want to say is some of the guys that do reactions against this sort of stuff, um, I, don't, I know I do stuff, but... I'll, I'll be honest, I go and review the guys, find out their information, and I don't really spin it onto the channel too much. I try and move away from that stuff if I can. Um, but one of the things that happens is people get a direct engagement with these people because you've got certain people that look for a reaction. They're making money off YouTube from it. So when you react, they then react because they're like, that worked. That's great. He he's now angry with me. Um, he's now wanting to threaten me or whatever. And then they do it again because they have distance. They, you don't know where they are. You don't know um, exactly enough about them to um, have some sort of direct connection. It is purely online. The way I analyze this, we're very simple. If we take several of the, we'll take several of the the people. I'm not going to mention anybody's names, but I will mention the the sort of profile. First thing is they're not making good money. They are, doesn't matter which one you take a look at. They're all exactly the same. So cash flow wise, for the guys that are trolling. The guys that they are trolling are often in a better position financially already. So there's a tick in the box. That's why you don't need to argue with these guys. Another one, happy relationships. All the guys I know that are being trolled are in happy relationships. The guys that are trolling them, how many of them in a happy relationship or any relationship whatsoever? I am. Okay. Um... So we've got financial stability, we've got um, stable relationships, happy relationships, and the third one would be doing what they want. The people that they're trolling are doing exactly what they want, be it whether it be like me in here in Spain, or the guys in the Philippines, or somebody wherever else on the planet. Now, if you look at the trolls, First one is, financially, they're often stuck. They're in a rut, they blame the world, everybody's to blame for their problems, etc., etc. Happy relationships, no chance. No chance. They all have histories in different forms, um, whether it's from drug abuse, um, domestic violence, or whatever. There is stuff in their own backgrounds they don't want to talk about, and this is part of the thing, they deflect. And doing what they want. Well, they obviously aren't. Why else would you waste your time trolling people? Um, because I know with certain individuals, it's because these other people are doing what they want to do, and they may have failed at it, they may have had something fall apart, maybe a marriage deteriorated, and they're hating people being happy in the Philippines, whatever the reason is, ultimately, they are not doing what they want. So, what's my big point on this? Why are you arguing with them? You already won. You know, if this was a competition, you already won. Just with those three things. I'm not even going in depth about, oh, he said this. or who. That's their level. Do not get down to that level. Um... Where this is a problem is it's damaging the community. These guys, if you ignore them, they are going to sit there and whine and go, notice me, notice me. 
nobody's listening to me anymore. And that's it. There's no secret to dealing with these guys. Just ignore them. You already win it. You already won. There is no competition. And that's one of the things I will say about the expat community as a whole. There is no competition. What I do in Spain here is my life doing what I want to do. I do not compare it to other people saying, well, I'm doing better than this. Or, I could care less what other people are doing. And one of the, I remember one of the trolls bringing this up. It's like, oh, well, so when, uh, when, when you've uh, come back to the Philippines and, uh, um, well, sorry, they said, oh, you're blacklisted from the Philippines. As I said to them, when I return to the Philippines, are you going to retract what you said? The answer is no. Because you're a troll. That's it. They talk garbage. They're abusive. They are non-productive. But don't let them destroy the Philippines community. They don't deserve it. Thanks for watching.